slave, master. Master is in the IO-A, which is the throttle. The slave is next to it in the B. I didn't want to mash it in the other one that's closer. My max current spike has been under 6, so I'm only pushing 6 amps through the servo bus. But anyway, um, here's what we get when we plug it in. Transmitter's on, so the satellites will light. Just resets. Golden. Plug it. I'm gonna try and just unhook the tail. Give us one less servo, perhaps. See what that does. Oops. Go back in. Apparently, does not help. Having a little less load. Satellites are all working though. Off. There, I've unhooked all but one servo. Um, just to see if maybe the load has something to do with it. Uh, let's find out. on up. Initializes the one servo. Let's try it again. Works again. Let's try one more time. Let's see what we have. She goes. Well, I guess what we have is a some sort of overload. I don't know. All I know is these servos do act weird when I was doing the setup and I only had what the 5.5 volts or whatever the minimum is the the Contronic puts out when you first start it. Um, Things did act really weird just like that. So that's what I mentioned before of having the uh, the pulsating issue and resetting. Once I set it to 8 volts, I've never had this issue again. It fires up and always works. So I don't know what the significance of today is to make it start doing it. But uh, that's what it's doing. So there we go. Thanks for watching.